What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to check it out the Star Wars Shop and Adventure Quest Worlds and Adventure Quest 3D. 3D actually has really cool items, stick around for that, they actually look really sick. I haven't seen them in game yet, but I saw screenshots, so let's get into the video. Alright, let's get it, let's get it with AQ first, of course, Adventure Quest Worlds Shops, Featured Gear. Now, we have a golden techno blade. Looks really nice. That's, that looks like a, I, I'm not a fan of that. Looks a little pointy for a lightsaber. A dagger of some sort, toxic energy blade, and an overclocked energy scythe for 200 ACs. Uh, for armors, we have nothing. For helmets, nothing. For capes, nothing. And, <laughs> What is that? A mass mulligan from the Mech Quest universe. Energy Blade combat experts. Best not make too many Lore Wars jokes while he's around. That actually looks really cool. And there's a non-member uh, version of that also. So, not the best. Uh, I think last year was probably the best Star Wars shop we ever had. Because, the or was it when they rebooted the Star Wars series? That one was probably the best one that we had. But, uh, that's not too bad. I, I kind of like this sword. But it's member only, so like no, not really the best non-member items, and the pet's pretty cool too. So that's it for the Veg Quest worlds. Let's check out AQ3D. Wow, uh, Veg Quest 3D actually they're stepping their game up a lot. Like this game looks a lot better than the last time I logged in. Uh, of course, they had Asphalt Part Two came out yesterday or the day before yesterday. Uh, so are there any more settings in the settings menu? No. I wonder if it locks my it doesn't lock my mouse to the window yet all right well still got some gripes with the game uh oh character page Did they update that oh shit it's taking me out of the game all right we're here for the star wars items character pages are still the same as they were before good to know let's go play all right loan in all right no we don't want that let's go to travel Battle on, battle on. Now here, hey, I actually need to use my keyboard to play a game. Haha. <laughs> so if you go over here to gods, or gaz. Oh wait, maybe it's not a gaz. There's a little mulligan here. That's crazy. Okay. Star swords. There's 700 coins each. Are you? S wow. And they're not even 3D. Are you? Are you serious? You're, that's the animation. Okay. Okay. How much is 700 coins? Minimum $5. So you're selling these for roughly less than $5, uh, like $4 a piece. I guess it's not too bad, but it's for a single sword. And the animation on them is not even a 3D animation. Ah, uh, that's not the that's not the greatest. I mean, this is Adventure Quest 3D, and the you can tell that the model of the blade, if you if you line it perfectly with the camera, the model on the blade has a slight 3D mesh to it. But the animation is a straight up 2D animation. It looks good from the side. Looks horrible. Like a piece of paper from the front. It's like that one uh, Family Guy sketch where they fall through the floor because they're so skinny. Okay, well, that's a disappointment. I saw a screenshot of that and I was like, oh, that looks really cool. But I see that in game and that's definitely not worth 750 coins. Uh, Gaz is black market. There's nothing here in the black market either. Okay, so it was just a star source that they keep 3 I was actually genuinely excited about The star swords, but they're 2d in a 3d game But why? All right. Well, I Thought oh, okay feels bad man. Um <laughs> Thank you for watching this video very disappointing. I Oh, that's just sad. Uh, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Uh, there'll be a news video up today also uh, based on Adventure Quest Worlds, not 3D. Even though Asphalt uh, Part 2 is out in AQ3D if you want to play that. Um, wow, that's just horrible. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Leave a like if you liked it. 
a dislike if you did not, and subscribe if you're not already. Peace.